Alright, here we are with another Mega Man Maker fan game. Um, we'll be playing through Kung Fu Cutman's Adventure, as you could see there by the title. Um, and yeah, this will be very exciting, I think. We have a lot of stages to cover, so yeah, I'll just probably just jump right into it here as I try explaining things. Apparently this game was completely made by Kung Fu Cutsman there. But I had some help from a couple of people, um, Snivy Master 1337 Yoshi2019, Mighty, Super Smash Gaming, and Minotaur there, okay. Yeah, so apparently they gave him feedback here on all stages, and yeah, look at this, we, <laughs> we're playing as bass and we have the cutter blade here, yeah, that's very appro appropriate, you know, what with the Cutman deal and all. I guess we're playing as Kung Fu Cutsman here. You know, since it's his game and all, that makes sense. Yeah, we don't have the double jump. And yeah, as you saw there, this is just the intro stage. This is just going to be a tutorial level of sorts, obviously. And yeah, it looks pretty sweet. I mean, look at this transition here. Very sweet looking. I played a few stages from Kung Fu Cutsman uh, in the past there, and yeah, he always makes some pretty useful. <laughs> useful yeah. He always makes some pretty. What's the word? He always makes some beautiful and, you know, some very creative stages too. I, I, I really like these stages. They're usually a lot of fun to play and they usually don't uh, get too difficult either. So yeah, they are usually just a trait to play here. And this here is a very nice layout here to teach about these guys. And yeah, we can't reach this, so we're going to have to use the jump here from Bass or the treble boost or whatever it's called. <laughs> mm. Yeah, and the cutter is actually a pretty good weapon to start out here because it can kill even those spine enemies there if you really want to get rid of them. Hmm. Yeah, once again, very interesting layout with how the enemies works in here. Hmm. hmm. Just wait and. Very nice. Oh. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, we're definitely gonna do the boost jumps here. It's the best, I think. Never up in the <laughs> up in the sky. And I don't think I've gotten hit yet. Like, the boss, I'm doing pretty well. I mean, it's just the intro stage, but still, you know. <laughs> still. Ooh, wow, look at that, dude. That was, that was cool. How the enemy moved there. Yep. Yeah, I would like, really like this intro stage so far. <laughs> Some good stuff in here. Not overly really easy either, you know, it's just pretty well balanced, I'd say. I wonder what, <laughs> what all this here is about. Oh, okay, okay, that's it. So yeah, that's basically... <laughs> that's basically the interest stage there. I wonder what that's supposed to be down there. That might be Dr. Light or something, or you know... This game has a lore, I, I did try and read it, but I... I, I didn't think, I haven't completely, you know, memorized exactly what it said there, but apparently, you know, it's uh, the KFC guys against the, uh, not the Skloof team, wait, was it that? <laughs> I don't exactly how it went, but basically a bunch of forum members against another bunch of forum members are, are duking it out, basically, is pretty much the story here. <laughs> so yeah, um... That's the first stage there, so yeah, in a second I'll just cut back and we'll jump into the first real stage there. Alright, so we're back here again. Um, I might post up the little robot master screen there just so that you can see what it looks like. I believe I'll be using it in the thumbnail too, but yeah, but let's just stretch it out a little bit here on the screen so you can see. Um, we have Snivy Master there. Um, Minotaur. Yo Yoshi, uh, Creative Eye, Ben, Mighty, Poisonous Gas, and Smash Gaming there, yeah. And I decided I'll be going with 
Sneevy Masters stage first, since I had the ID on the top of the page here. And I believe that when we defeat the Sneevy Masters stage here, we'll get a weapon. Yeah, we'll get the Wine Whip, also known as the Thunder Claw. Okay, very nice. Oh yeah, and you also get to keep E-Tanks um, from stage to stage. So yeah, pretty much um, it's going to be very important that we you know, keep track of them so that we get to keep as many as possible and don't you know i don't want to use them if i don't have to so yeah i'll definitely do my best here to try and stack him up but yeah here we have the armory room i guess yeah so i don't have any e-tanks you know from the interstage stage there so i may not pick any up and we haven't done any bosses so you know might not <laughs> i might not i may not pick any up there okay so the first real stage here by snivy master I actually beat the state tree in a while back, you know. <laughs> yeah, he's a pretty cool guy, I gotta say. And this looks pretty traditional here, I gotta say. And it's just a shame uh, I don't have the headset in, so I barely hear any music. <laughs> you guys will hear it, but yeah. I can't turn it out too loud because then... Yeah, it will reverberate and we'll hear <laughs> double the soundtracks. And what the heck is this? This is some kind of a maze, I guess. Holy crap. I don't want to fall too fast here, though, because I might die. And I wonder, I probably need to double check in case, you know, we have to keep track of our one-ups, too. That might be a thing. Okay, let's just lure this guy up here. Very nice. <laughs> hmm. I gotta admit, I'm a little bit lost here. I'm just going to keep going in until I find something here. Hmm. I don't think I've been down here. No, I have not been here yet. Okay. Whoa. <laughs> hmm. Yeah. KFC man is in a pinch here. Ooh. There it is, the teleporter. Okay, so it's in the middle, not at the bottom, I see. There might actually be a E-Tank hidden in here somewhere, it would not surprise me, but yeah. I'm just gonna keep on trucking here. Hmm. We're back outside. Yeah, I like this stage too, yeah. Nice scenery changes here. Just bait this guy down here, take him out. Yeah, I'm definitely, definitely gonna check this here out. Who? Wait, I can't do this. Hmm. I need the thunder claw for that. There was a boss, a bass, a boss door down there, so maybe we gotta go down, kill the boss, and hopefully it drops the thunder claw, and we can perhaps go back through there. Maybe, or maybe we can, you know, come back to the stage later. After we get the thunder claw from the main boss here, I'm not sure how it will work out this year. And Jesus Christ, I'm taking a beating. Ooh, and look, this is probably where you would exit from that room that we saw back there, the thunder claw room. Hmm. Thank you, that was very much needed. And thank you again, wow. Very nice. Okay, I'm down here. No, okay, I thought the boss room would be down here. Oh, wait, 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 he's down here, actually. Yeah. Down here. Yeah, okay. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Hopefully it drops the weapon that I need here. Oh, wow, look at this. Dude, that's really cool. <laughs> How did it come from up there? Huh. Yeah, <laughs> very, very awesome. Ooh, okay. Luckily, Bubble Man can't get his bubbles out too. Then it would actually be pretty hard this year, I think. Because his bubble would deal 4 damage a pop, so yeah. But I should have this. Unless I start making stupid things like that. <laughs> As for the video lengths of this uh, playthrough here, I'm not sure how I'll handle it. I'll probably do 
one to two stages, you know, per video, except for this first one. The first one will be longer, you know, since we had the intro stage in here, but yeah. And I'll probably post a KFC man video every other day or something like that. And, you know, keep playing regular stages on the side so that we don't, you know, only play these types of, you know, this type of game here, so to speak. I've done that in the past, but yeah, I noticed that, you know, they do tend to take a while to complete, so yeah. I'll probably switch it up a little bit this time around here. Now we're back in the maze again, and we did not get a weapon. Hmm. Wait, is this the same maze? What? Hmm. This looks like the same maze. Or is something different? <laughs> uh. Hmm. I am very confused. Hmm. Let's see here. There is the teleporter, okay. Let's just jump into it. Yeah, we're here again. No, 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 this is a new segment. Huh. Oh, no, no, no! Oh, crap, dude. Crap. All right, here we are. Thank you again, not this time. Let's be very careful not to screw up here. Hmm. There we go. Okay. And... Nice. Uh, yeah, 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 okay. Gotta be very careful here. You know, this would be very hard without... Oh my god, what a jump! This would be very hard without bra brass here, brass here. Yeah, probably even impossible. Ooh, definitely, it would be impossible without brass. Holy crap, holy cow, that was... Yeah, that was really <laughs> pretty freaking difficult, actually. <laughs> but yeah, I made it, and finally we got a new checkpoint there. That's a very welcome sight here. Very, very welcome. Incredibly happy about it. Ooh, and this here looks quite cool. <laughs> Visually speaking, I like this rock mixing here. Mm -hmm. But yeah, I can't help but wonder, like... I don't know... Like the thundercloud, did I miss something coming in here? Or yeah, I'm not sure. I might have missed something. I really hope I didn't. That would be a shame. This here looks like the main gate to the boss here. Hmm. It's telling me sea kick. Maybe it's weak to the sea kick. It's probably what that is referring to there. Oh wait, are there two? There are two bosses in here. Oh, okay, okay, okay. There is a... Yeah, yeah, yeah. There is the... Charge man somewhere in here. Or whatever it's called. <laughs> yeah, I'm not too worried here. I think I got this. Yeah, but this is gonna take a while. <laughs> this is going to take a while. Hmm. Yeah, hopefully I don't get crushed here too often by the charge guy. Top spin man or snivy master <laughs> is easy enough to dodge, but yeah, charge man can be a problem here if I'm not careful. Okay, but yeah, we have a nice lead on in here, so not too worried. Yeah, we should have him here. Definitely should have. We have to screw up majorly, like fall into the water or something. <laughs> That's pretty much the only way I can fail this now. And uh, now two more shots here. Okay, let's just go in for it. Yeah. Finish the fight. 
But yeah, pretty sweet, pretty sweet, like, unique concept there, like, it looked like a little maze level. <laughs> yeah, I haven't really seen a maze in a traditional stage yet. Luckily it wasn't too hard, you know, <laughs> the maze there, it was pretty easy finding your way through. Um, once, you know, I had walked through them there a little bit, you know, you started to get the gist of it, knew exactly how to go. Let's see here. Interest day, the Skloof Masters. Here we are. Um, oh, I see. I picked the wrong stage. Oh no, I went with the. <laughs> I did not go into Snivy Master stage. I went into Minotaur stage. <laughs> Whoops, that was Minotaur Man stage. Okay. Hmm, well, interesting. So we got the C kick from doing that. Center Man stage, but now it's semi fluted and labyrinths. Hmm. Yeah, very interesting. So we got the C kick there. However, now we're going to go into Snivy Master stage. So yeah, see you there in a sec. <laughs> Dude, I can't believe how stupid I am. Look at this. Look at this. It says KH Magnetar, and I still do not realize it. That's the brain power of me. <laughs> Holy cow. Holy freaking cow, am I stupid. Okay, so <laughs> here we are with Snivy Master stage. Snivy Master 1337. Let's go right into it, and now we may pick up the C kick there from the last stage, so that's pretty cool. Hmm. I'm sure it will come in handy a whole bunch of times. Uh, um, I'm actually kind of happy we, you know, did Minotaur Man's stage first there. You know, just said we have some more maneuverability here than we already do. Like, Bass and the C kick is very powerful. Let's see. Mm hmm there it is. I'ma get it. Hmm. Yeah, let's just jump right into it and wow dude this looks sick. What the heck? This actually looks looks sick. Yeah. Wait, hold on, let me just this here. Yeah, but this here like <laughs> yeah, what a nice nice starting screen here I gotta say. Visually impressive I Hmm. Whoa, okay, dude, I got <laughs> owned there. Yeah, once again, very nice transition here, you know. Indoors to outdoors, yeah. <clears throat> me like, me like. <laughs> he can't actually hurt me. <laughs> well, at least not until his head. Flies off anyway. I'm just gonna skip this guy here. They usually hit me and they hit, they hit hard too, so. <laughs> and I could skip this guy too, which I probably will. Yeah, look at this. This C kick is so handy. But yeah, the cutter weapon isn't. It isn't the strongest weapon against these guys here. That for sure, since you can't, you know, hit them very often, you need to be able to f uh, fire rapidly there. I guess. <laughs> Whoa, okay. Very nice checkpoint placement. <laughs> checkpoint placement there, and ooh, jeez. Hmm. That probably looked harder than it actually was. I, I was a little bit nervous though. I gotta say, or I, I was a little bit nervous. Mm -hmm. Some kind of a boss up there. I can also go here and it was totally worth it. Very nice. Very happy I went over there. Okay, so now I just gotta remember that we picked up an E tank here in this stage, so yeah. I should probably write that down on a list here. Hold on a second, guys. Let me go get a pen. Alright, there we go. So now I have a little piece of paper here where I'll be marking, you know, how many E-tanks I have. So, yeah, so that I don't forget. I guess I could just have done it on the computer, but, you know, I'm an old-fashioned guy. I write on paper. <laughs> Holy cow, what is this? Hmm. <laughs> Pretty cool, I gotta say. I wonder what they are supposed to be enclosed in there. Kind of looks like some kind of train or something like. Or wagon, I'm not sure, but it looks cool anyway. 
Yeah, here they <laughs> cut their weapon is actually very helpful since you can hit both at once. Even though we only did one damage, you can still hit both. <laughs> yeah. You're actually going down pretty fast. Whoops, <laughs> walked into that. Very easy. Can we get up here? Can we do something? I don't think we can do anything up there, so yeah, I'm just, I'm just leave it. Ooh, and look at this! We're inside here now! <laughs> Whoa, dude, that was a cool entrance! <laughs> yeah! Awesome stuff! Whoa, oh my god, dude, did I luck out or what? It seems like you keep your momentum when you do the bass jump there and land on the springs there. I actually, I'm not sure I knew about that. That's important to keep in mind though, that you keep, it, you keep in the momentum there. Hmm, yeah. <laughs> Look over here what we got. Hmm. Yeah. Very careful here with how I handle this, and we probably should have this out. Or actually not, because we can't use the treble bo uh, booster or whatever it's called. Like this jump here. Yeah, there we go. And I would like to destroy this guy here. In case he drops some health, I'm very low, and holy cow, he got a hit on me. Now I'm pretty much forced to try and beat him, but yeah, he only dropped energy. Oh no! Oh no 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 no! Oh crap! Crap 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 crap! Crap 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 crap! <laughs> hmm. Yeah, the odds of me surviving here now just got very low. But yeah, there's no way I'm using the E-Tank, that's... <gasps> yeah, <laughs> the E-Tank is out of the question, but now I'm feeling much better here. And this here is actually harder than it looks. Um, I gotta say... There. Not screw you guys. I'm going home. I'm, go I'm moving on. Oh crap, I should not have done that. Move! And <laughs> get out of there! Hmm. Okay, you know what? Ooh, yeah. Look at this, you actually... I think you actually have to do that here. Like the slide jump so that you boost on here. Oh my god, don't hold down A, you idiot! Oh. Ooh. Yeah, <laughs> cutting back. Let's do this again here. Nice, that's how you do it. Okay. Um, I'm a bit scared here though. Oi, oi, oi. Dude, that was a sick segment once I just knew how to do it. But yeah, that was really cool. Please don't kill me. Oh no. Shit. Oh! <laughs> I'm out of here! Holy cap! Holy cow! I went out! I went out! <laughs> I made it! I made it! Dude! But I like that segment up there was really freaking tricky! Um, But yeah, like once I knew what to do there, it wasn't so bad. It was actually kind of clever in a way. Like, using the... Well, you know what, I'm just gonna suicide that. Yeah, Snivy Master used the... You know, the momentum that you get from the uh, treble boost here, or you know, the, the speed boost from dashing with Bass here. And you know, you had to use that to jump over those gaps back there. And yeah, at the same time, you had to pre shoot that fly there. And yeah, it was a lot of. Yeah. <laughs> a lot of technicalities in there. It was not easy by any means. Here we have Magnet Man. Yeah, yeah, it's got a pretty nice movement pattern in here, I gotta say, with how the room works and all. And it would be nice if I could start timing that a little bit better. <laughs> so I get to kill him sometime today. Yeah, the low ceiling there makes him fire that much faster too, so yeah, that makes him deadlier too. 
I'll probably just start doing this here, you know, aiming this way. Get the guaranteed hit here. Yeah, very nice. Keep doing that, Magnet Man. Keep doing it and I'll win. Luckily though, he can't do too much with his sucking there, like even if he sucks me, like, there is really no harm in it. So, like, the only thing you have to watch out for here is the magnets. Whoa, he actually, <laughs> he actually got down there. Hmm. Oh my god, is he, is he going to win now? Oh, oh no, I'm getting nervous. Oh, <gasps> no! Dude! Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Am I going to lose here? Oh, oh my god! He, he almost launched a comeback on me there. He almost launched a comeback. Holy cow! And this video is up to 36 minutes. Yeah, so we're definitely gonna end it here. <laughs> Holy cow! But yeah, that was an interesting stage. Really freaking hard, but nonetheless very interesting at the same time. So. Yeah, I, I will just leave it at that. Thank you guys for watching, and have a nice day.